How's it going guys? My name is Jinjib and welcome back to Forza Motorsport 6 for another drag build with the Porsche pack. Today we have the Porsche 911 GT2 RS. Now, here's the thing about these cars. They are rear wheel drive and rear engine. That means all the weight is back on those rear wheels so they grip up really well. Or at least that's the idea. I'm counting on when we have lots of power, lots of torque, and we floor it off the line, all the weight shifts onto the back wheels, and we grip up, and we go. But I don't know what will happen. Hopefully that works. Um, let's get to it. Now, I'm going to try to keep this all Porsche. No engine swaps. No, none of, none of that shit. Um, I can make it all-wheel drive. I can't even swap the engine. I don't have that option. Um, so, it's actually a little interesting. I'm not sure if I agree with that, but... We're twin turboed, um, flat six, inline six. It's not a V6, as many people have pointed out. Let's fully upgrade this engine. You know, all all the used stuff. I'm hoping it upgrades pretty well. That's really the thing. Mirror engines tend to upgrade well. Older cars, you know, sometimes you put an upgrade on it and it doesn't do much. Hopefully that's not the case on this one. I mean, the exhaust puts it up 30 horsepower. Dude, I wish that happened with my car. Whew. Adding a camshaft onto this car is almost how much horsepower my car has. Like, my, my my car has 94 horsepower stock. Brand new. So it probably has, like, 90. And this is given at 70. Shit, son. The real goodies happen when I do this. Oh, it's only 74 horsepower. Huh. It's actually kind of surprising from a twin turbo race setup. Um, but it looks like we are going to be... <laughs> What are the chances, guys? What are the chances? We have 918 horsepower. It's not a 918, but it is a Porsche. So, 918 horsepower, 700 foot-pounds of torque. Cool. Nice thing to do is weight reduction. That's actually the only thing I can do. So, that brings us down to 2,700 pounds. Um, these cars are kind of bland in their upgrades, but that's okay. I mean, for a drag build, you kind of fully upgrade it, and then you tune it. So, it's not that interesting anyway, but with all this, looks like we're sitting pretty. Now, the very important thing is this rear tire width. 345s, okay, that's pretty good. It's not incredible, but look at that stance. That booty, though. That looks really, really nice. I love the Porsche booty. I'm not, I'm not so thrilled about the front, but the booty. Ho oh, ho, the booty is nice. Sunny sun sun. All right. Well, there's that and then putting it to drag slicks That's gonna give us an acceleration of 10. Yeah, buddy I do really love the stock wheels, but they're kind of heavy. So we can get some lighter stuff on here And honestly these wheels look very much like the stock wheels and they're light. So let's do it This is the one time I wish I could actually make the wheels smaller. That'd be a cool option to do in Forza You get more weight reduction more grip all right, it's all done. Fully upgraded everything, which gives us 918 horsepower, 736 foot-pounds of torque, and we weigh 2,737 pounds. Now, rear engine, we will drive. If you look at the weight distribution, it's all in the back, so that's awesome. I love it. Um, let's tune it. I'm going to put the rear tire pressure down 27.5. If you put it all the way down like this, it makes you slower, supposedly. It's what the little calculator says off to the left. I don't really know if you're supposed to trust that or not, but rear tire pressure down, front tire pressure all the way up. Now, rear camber, none of that shit. We want the most grip we possibly can get, and we want the least drag we can possibly get, so front camber all the way down, toe, or no, angle caster, um, and then zero, zero. That dropped the time by 0.02 seconds. Nice. Then I stiffen the rear and soften the front. Go like that, which shaved an entire tenth of a second off of Reserve 60 time. There you go, boys. The more you learn. Oh. Oh, goodness. What have I done? The top speed. It says failed. What the hell is that supposed to mean? I want to drive it. Wait, wait. What have we done? Oh, that's what we've done. <laughs> I knew it. Okay. Well, in an attempt to make a drag car, we've made a wheelie car. <laughs> <laughs> and that's a pretty good wheelie. That's as good as this car is going to get before it starts scraping. Oh my goodness! <laughs> it was doing a wheelie in second gear. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, hold on. I think we've stumbled onto something fantastic, so I'm actually going to legitly race this. 
See what times we can get. <laughs> it's not gonna be good, but it's gonna be fun. Once it like once it gets going, it's alright. But ooh, that took a long. Oh, hey, <laughs> I can I can still run a 10 second quarter mile with a mad wheelie. Question is, can you like? Nope, nope, okay, nope, nope, this is, oh my goodness. It's definitely not the fastest this way, but can it do a wheelie the entire quarter mile? No. That was actually pretty good. That was fast. Go, 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 go! In an eight second car? Oh! I think this thing is just honestly a spaceship. I mean, it looks like a spaceship, and it drives like a spaceship. Well, that was actually pretty decent, too. Ob like, obviously, I'm not going to be the fastest with the wheelie here, but um, I can run eight seconds consistently. 8.8 .8 with a wheelie, so that's that's fantastic. Let's fix it now. To get rid of this wheelie, I'm going to put the rebound stiffness back to kind of usual. Um, that gives us an eight second. <laughs> like That makes this a lot faster. So back to usual, um, and I think I'll also lock the diff. A little tiny change can make you wheelie or not wheelie, so the more you know. Science, am I right? Wash it wheelie, but... Oh, well, looks like it's not a simple fix, because uh, that was definitely a wheelie. However, I feel like it was a little better, so I think I can manage to not wheelie. Let's, let's try it, like 4K. No, no, it's pretty easy to wheelie. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> that's cool though. Problem is that it's not really the torque that's wheeling, it's the power. So even like if you don't launch it at like a high RPM, it will wheelie. Like let's just launch it from like 2K. Oh shit, well that stalled. 4K. See, I still wheelie even though I didn't like rev it up. But I mean that was fast. That was really fast. Um, oh shit, dude. Stand station, I mean... That thing is tucking rim hard, and I think that splitter is like a centimeter off the ground. But then you get back here and it looks sick. That's like the biggest drag stance ever. It's got some mad camber and oh, hovercraft fitment, but it's a wheelie car, it's a drag car, and now it's a stance car. What's next? Oh my god, that booty dough. So to fix this, we're just gonna bring these closer together. Um, well, yeah. God damn it! You've got too much grip, car! <laughs> um, bring them closer together, I guess. I swear to God, if this does a wheelie. Lots oh, of wheelie for sure. Whoa! Whoa! Come on, keep it going! Keep it going! Yes! Yeah! What? What's going on? <laughs> uh, come on, yes, all, the entire quarter mile. Keep going. Go, 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 go! It's because I'm scraping against the wall, I know, but go, go, go! Yes, you're so close! <laughs> I literally just did a quarter mile long wheelie in a Porsche. What the fuck is going on? Oh my god. I don't know what to call this car. Like, I don't know if it's a wheelie car or if it's a drag car now. It's just, my mind is blown. So I'm gonna bring the rear stiffness on the springs back and the front stiffness a little, little back as well. The challenge is now to make the car not wheelie. I don't want it to wheelie. Fucking Christ, it just, it always pops a wheelie. You know, in some ways it's so freaking awesome because it's just so damn grippy. But in other ways, it's quite annoying, you know? I think it's safe to say that these are one of the easiest wheelie cars to build, but... If you're careful on the throttle, you can do it without wheeling. Um, that's for sure. But you have to be damn careful. It's crazy. <laughs> so cool! All right, can I get a good time? The question is, can I not wheelie? <laughs> See, like the moment it pops up, you gotta take your foot off the throttle or your finger off the, the trigger, but... Oh my god! This is almost a seven second car. What the fuck? This is the literal definition of a rocket. No! Ugh, if only I could do it without wheeling every time. Ah! And still, like, it's... <laughs> My assumption about it being super grippy since it's rear engine was correct. This thing is insane.
like <laughs> oh my god it's just currently driver error that's holding me back um i think i'm gonna try to put it in a second like right after i launch it which kind of sends me into the wall that was hard to control but oh all right, it wasn't as fast. Don't really, don't really, don't really, don't really. That was good. Shifted in second quickly. And, oh, 8.35. I think that's the best time yet. No. Well, actually, it kind of bogged down there, which in some ways is almost nice. Ah, <laughs> uh, 8.4. Honestly, this just might be NASA's new car. Imagine if NASA built the car. That was good. The moment it started popping up, shifted it into second. Oh, my God! Oh, an 8.2! I honestly think... With a little bit more tuning, you could make this a seven second car. Like, just look at the speedot. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to make it like not wheelie. So if you're gonna put this way down, like make this like that and that, which according to the little testing over to the left, it says it makes it slower, which Sadly, is probably true, but let's test it. Still, still, yeah. We're gonna save this setup as drag wheel because I'm too lazy to type wheelie or even wheel right. So, yep. Now we're gonna make it the default tune by resetting it, and now we're gonna see if it wheelies. This is on a stock tune, all right. This car wheelies on a stock tune. What? I think this is literally the only car that you can just fully upgrade it and it and it does a wheelie. What? That's so freaking crazy. Like, that's a stock tune. I don't get it. Oh my god, this thing is just, it's a monster. That's what it is. It's a 900 horsepower grip beast. It's like, what? Ugh, it's, just, it's crazy. I'm going to try doing the opposite of what a normal wheelie tune is to maybe counteract the wheeliness inside. Nope. Still does a wheelie. Still does a freaking wheelie. <laughs> That's it. I'm making the rear all the way soft and the front all the way stiff. Something that you would not normally do. In fact, that's the complete opposite you'd normally do. Oh, it doesn't really wheelie like it kind of did. Oh. Huh. But it's so much less grippy, you know? I don't think it's worth it. All right. Anti-wheelie tune. Let's see if this is better. I'm guessing it's not going to be, honestly. Well, I don't know. It was pretty damn fast. Holy shit, this thing is just... Oh, my God. That was so close. I just want to make a seven-second car. Come on. Come on. Oh, no. This is fucking close. Oh. Because this shit is just insane, son. Oh, I popped a wheelie at the end there. Saved it, though. Come on. Come on. Ugh. But seriously, like, still, this is a rear wheel drive car that's running 8.1. 8.1. It's unheard of. It's so fast. It's so fast. Go. Okay, so it's not gonna do it like this. It's so close, but it's not gonna do it. So we're gonna put all wheel drive on it. Six and a half hours later. Maybe if I could throw a NASCAR engine in here, be a little bit faster. It's like, ugh, 
It's like literally so close. <laughs> uh, oh well, it's a, it's it's so incredibly fast. I think a good name for this would be the Cohen Seg Killer, Hypercar Murderer, Supercar Slayer. Honestly, this thing is so insane. With real drive, it wheelied no matter what, and it got so much traction. It was just insane. All wheel drive, same 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 story. It's just such a fast car. With a little bit more power, maybe a little bit lighter, it would have been a seven second car. And I bet you one I bet one of you guys out there can make it a seven second car. So that's your challenge. Send me a pic on Twitter if you get it. Check out my other videos. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you next time. Peace. Peace. Did it even get to oh. And they're off. Oh.